Hi everybody, I'm Congressman Roger Marshall from the Big First District of Kansas. Let me welcome you all to your virtual fly-in and just say thank you uh, to everybody. Special shout out to a good friend of mine, the 2019 Hospice Ambassador of the Year from the state of Kansas, Sandy Coleman. Now Sandy may not remember this, but we actually met in about 2015 when I went to visit the Rotary Club there in Phillipsburg, Kansas and asked what were they proud of, what projects had they been working on that they would say was their signature project. And it was the fundraising and the work they had done with the local hospice program, which Sandy was leading. Uh, so proud of all the work that hospices do across the country. Um, I'm old enough in medicine to remember as a medical student and a resident when many communities did not have a hospice program and seeing patients and family members watch their loved one die alone without that emotional support, the comfort support we gave as well, the physical and emotional comfort uh, was just a tragedy. And I'm just so grateful for the, for the huge hearts that you all have helping people through their most difficult of times. I don't take it for granted. I'll I'll keep working on policy that will help put wind beneath your cells. And finally, I just want to close with a, with a positive word, a message of hope that we're going to make it through this virus together. I appreciate you all being out in the front line, though, and, um, and, and helping folks, even though there is COVID going on. I'm very optimistic we're going to have a vaccine for the vulnerable by Thanksgiving, a vaccine for those who choose to get it probably sometime by the new year. Meanwhile, therapeutics have much improved, doctors and nurses, uh, the greatest healthcare system system in the world taking care of people. So again, congratulations to Sandy. Thank you for all of you for participating in this fly-in. Be safe and God bless.